One, we just spoke to your head coach, and he says you know the mood's been good anyway, but it's not done yet. But there does seem to be sort of a, a lifting of the cloud, shall we say? Yeah, yeah. It's a. I feel. To be honest, I feel a little bit like the weight's been lifted off our, off everyone's shoulders. Really, um, a bit of a joke that we've found ourselves in this situation. Um, should never have been in this situation. Um, and you know, there's still a little bit more to to do until we can officially say, obviously, that it's done. But no, I'm I'm really happy that we've. It was it's a real swing of emotion because after the game on Tuesday, I'm absolutely elated that you know, for the fans, obviously, really importantly that they've they've had a good bit of the season because the season has been a struggle. It's been a struggle one and off the pitch. There's, it's been a bit of a nightmare really and then obviously they've had their moment and I, we had uh, us as players had our moment and then you get back in the dressing room and then you know you, you find yourself I don't want to over over cheer and things because I've just stayed up in League 2 and it's not the reason why I come to this football club so um, real difference of, uh, of emotions but yeah I'm really glad and proud that we actually got that got that game out of the way and we and we done with we done done it the way that we done it I thought it was really good I thought we were really professional we stuck to the game plan um, and yes, always, always lovely to get one over your rivals. Yeah, you, you say you, you don't want to have a sense of pride or cheer. The fact you've, you've, you know, you've, you've all but stayed up, but you dug yourselves into the hole. So it takes a lot of character to, to dig yourselves out of it, especially with the amount of criticism that was flying around because there was a lot. Yeah, but um, we, we deserved it. Um, we, 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 we where we are for a reason. And like I said, I didn't join this football club to for, for, to be in this sort of situation. So. Yeah, I'm, um, I'm looking forward to the last three games. I'm looking forward to try and take the last two performances um, going forward. But it's not like a light switch. You can't switch it on and off. It needs to be on all season. And as a club, we've proven that, that we can do it the, the previous years. But we this, this season, we, we just haven't done it. Because this is it now, isn't it? You, you haven't done all the hard work just to, just to throw it away for the, for the last three games. There is still that little bit of work still to do, as we know, just to get that point, points tally that you need. But it's, it's all but there, depending on what happens elsewhere. But you, you want to go out on a high with the last three games, don't you? Yeah, one word I think that just springs to mind is probably mentality. So we'll see a lot from ourselves. We'll see a lot from individuals with these with these three games to go. So, like you say, definitely it's not over. Um, so we need to, we need to still need to put some points on the ball. But yeah, like I said, individually, I think it's, it's, it's massive that there's a lot of people out of contract. There's a lot of people with their own thing going on. A lot of different situations. Obviously, there's a lot of uncertainty of what's going on at the moment surrounding the club. Um, so we need to brush all that off and and as a collective just. Or, or pulling us in the same direction.